Hi, I'm Miss Jenny with Miss Jenny's Cleaning, and um, thanks for tuning into my video. If you, that was a bug. If you like my videos, please uh, remember to subscribe, and also don't forget to shake hands with the little like hand down at the bottom if you like this particular video. Now, what I want to talk about to, today on this particular video, it's not really about cleaning, but um, I'm so happy with the results that I've had from taking garlic that I really wanted to share it with everybody. Um, you know, indirectly, cleaning our mouths is a cleaning issue, hygiene, etc. So, um, what happened is, if you look right here, I'm a little swollen. Two days ago, this was like an egg on my face. And, um, the back story is I have a tooth that had a root canal in it about maybe about eight years ago and the root canal is failing so about two months ago is when I started having problems and I went to the dentist and they took x-rays and they actually wanted to pull two teeth the tooth with the root canal and the tooth in front of it because that's where the infection in the um, x-ray was showing so they gave me an antibiotic the swelling went away I don't really want to pull my teeth. Um, I'm getting to the point, I'm, I'm not young, I'm obviously not young, and I want to hold on to my teeth as long as I can. I paid a lot of money for that root canal. And um, I've had some other extractions, so keeping the teeth I have right now is even more important you know, than ever because I'm just not ready for dentures yet. So, um, I didn't get the tooth pulled and um, the infection went away but it came back and like I said a couple days ago this was like a big goose egg here and um, so I don't want to go back to the dentist or to you know an urgent care or anything like that because I know they're gonna tell me I have to go to a dentist and have the tooth either get a new root canal or get it pulled and that's just not an option at this time so I started looking online for um, natural antibiotics almost out of a desperate measure um, sort of or to try to at least figure out what I wanted to do and I came across using garlic actually specifically for toothaches so what happened was um, everything every all these articles are telling you to place the garlic in your mouth bite down on it and so on and so forth because they're referring to teeth that have a cavity in it, an open wound, basically. And this particular tooth that I'm having trouble with has a crown on it. When I look at the tooth, there's nothing that I can see that is showing what the problem is. But having been to the dentist, I know that it's a failed root canal, which in, in my particular case means that something's going on underneath the crown, underneath the root. Now. Um, so anyway, what I did was I, I found um, these articles on using garlic for um, as a natural antibiotic, and most you know they were saying to apply it to the tooth. Well, I came upon a couple other articles and videos and so on, and they were talking about eating garlic, fresh garlic. This has to be fresh garlic, by the way. It can't be cooked garlic. Or powdered garlic um, has to be fresh raw garlic okay but the the information was mixing it with all these different things and I get that there are properties with vinegar and yogurt and bananas there are properties that are applicable but um, it did, sorry about that it didn't seem um, I just I can't I'm picky, okay? That's the truth. I'm picky about what I eat. So, garlic flavored yogurt or garlic flavored bananas isn't going to cut it for me. And mixing garlic in with vinegar, which I actually like, but to the amount that I need for it to be effective, it's a little potent. Garlic is very strong and it can burn and, you know, it, um, I just didn't want to go through that. So, what I did was I took an average size clove of garlic. It wasn't small, it wasn't big, it was just the average size. And, and I cut it up and I made it into four pieces about the size of a regular pill. And I took this clove of garlic three times a day. 
this is my third day. I've taken one dose today. And um, it, almost immediately, it started going down. Um, the swelling started going down. It really doesn't even hurt now. I just feel a little pressure in there. There's still a little bit of infection. I've taken my first dose this morning. And I'll take two more before the day is out. Just like I would a regular antibiotic. And um, I'm expecting this to be gone by the end of the week. Um, but I made a decision because I have this root canal and um, the things that I've read about garlic using garlic as an antibiotic so it's not just for your teeth it's also for other parts of your body um, once I get this under control I think I'm just gonna take garlic every day just like some people take a birth control pill or a blood pressure pill or you know other types of medication I'm just gonna eat a clove of garlic a day now I probably should have said at the beginning of the video I'm not a doctor I don't have medical training um, it's just a decision that I've made based on the results that I see here and you can see it's not really that swollen it's a little swollen and this is not really a very flattering position for this camera because I'm kind of coming up at my face but that's so that you can see I wish you could have seen it two days ago because it was it was so swollen there was like an indent right here it was puffed out and um, right now it doesn't hurt I can feel a little tight in here like inside my mouth where it's swollen probably a little bit in there but I mean I can pr look I can really press on I can feel the pressure in the tooth when I press in certain spots but it doesn't hurt and it was hurting believe me um, so it's getting better it's getting better and I guess the other disclaimer is I'm not I'm not a hyper um, naturalist or herbalist, you know, but I do believe that God made plants for certain purposes and garlic is one of them. So in my case, I've just, I made a decision to hold on to my tooth and not have it removed and I don't, I don't regret it. So I don't know, maybe in a couple months I'll die because I got some kind of brain infection or heart infection, but today I'm feeling good and I can see the results. So again, thank you for watching. Um, again, if you like my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to hit the like button. Thank you. Bye-bye.